Finally, add-ons. I will now be able to mod this game to be the best player ever. Uh, that's not how add-ons work for this game. Yeah, uh, what do you know, Chris? I'm just saying that add-ons and Elder Scrolls Online aren't like Skyrim add-ons. They don't make you better. They enhance the experience, give you tips, and make things quicker and more obvious. So what you're saying is that I can't rain down thousands of My Little Pony themed cabbages on my enemies in PvP? Not exactly, no. Sweet rolls? No. Pumpkins? No. Fishy sticks? If I lie to you and say yes, will you leave, like, forever? Yes. Then yes. I can't believe he would just lie to me like that. Hello everybody and welcome to a video that will show you my top 5 favorite add-ons for the Elder Scrolls Online. Now some people enjoy PvE, while others enjoy PvP. Well, I have a combination of add-ons that should help you out in both. Add-ons that I've been using for the past little while to enhance my experience with the game. The first add-on is the Advanced UI. Have you ever wanted to see every single bit of damage you caused your enemy to die from? Then the Advanced UI is for you. Not only does this add-on give you every little bit of detail with the healing, damage caused, and damage received, it includes its very own little mini-map. This add-on also gives you easy access to your potions, food, siege weapons, and other quick slot items simply by adding a secondary bar in which you can assign to different keys. But my favorite part about this add-on is the fact that it literally tells you every single little drop of health, stamina, and magicka that you have, and your enemy's health. I know everything about you, little bandit. The next add-on is my build. Have you ever wondered what the heck kind of monster you've created? Well, look no further. By typing slash my build, your game will organize everything about your character, giving you a much more detailed look at everything you have equipped, all the champion points you've used, which Mundus stone you're currently using, and everything you could ever want to know about your character. And most importantly, it tells you your character's name. Next, we've got three add-ons all in one, Undiscovered, Lore Books, and Sky Shards. I cannot tell you how useful these add-ons would be for me, helping me discover all of the missing locations on my map, and then being able to find all of the different lore books and sky shards. You don't have to download all three, only the ones that you will actually use, but each one is pretty self-explanatory. Undiscovered will help you find missing locations, sky shards will help you find the missing sky shards, and the lore books will help you find food and weaponry. Yes, this will take away from the whole experience of exploration. But come on, you have to admit it, that when you've got this add-on combined with the advanced UI, you're like a walking exploration machine. No one will ever be able to trick you into finding fake locations ever again. And then you walk past the sea of you're an idiot. Mm-hmm. Into the desert of you're so stupid and gullible. Mm, yes, go on. And then you end off at the Valley of Forgotten Souls. Ha! <laughs> Caught you red-handed! It's the Valley of Forgotten Snakes, not souls, moron! For the next add-on, we have the Craft Store, a handy tool that displays everything to do with, well, crafting. It'll display all of your light, medium, and heavy armors, your different weapons, and all of the way that you have enhanced them or can enhance them. This allows you to figure out all of your gear without the need to go to a specific crafting station. This add-on also gives you the information of the different motive books that you know, what provisioning recipes you have acquired, and the current research progress for your gear. This add-on also gives you the option to quick travel, by using gold of course, to the way shrine of the nearest crafting locations. But the most important thing about this add-on is that it allows you to utilize the most ultimate recipe in the game. Steak in a bowl. Lastly, we've got a great add-on for designing and saving your own custom skill sets, armor, and weapon sets, and then lets you store them for later. This add-on is called Alpha Gear. This add-on is incredibly helpful and extremely easy to use. All you need to do is open up the Alpha Gear icon and you're ready to go. If you're wanting to add certain things to a certain set, all you have to do is hold shift and then click. But if you're wanting to remove that certain stuff from that set, all you have to do is hold control and then click. And then when you want to actually equip that set, just give it a nice old regular click of the mouse. Fregland organized his set, but he didn't click his mouse. Fregland will forever be used as an example. And there you have it, my top 5 favorite add-ons to use. But remember, young Padawan children people, there is one add-on that doesn't simply come from the internet. It comes from the heart. And it is not an add-on, it is the ability to-